Louisiana Attorney General Jeff Landry is joining 15 other Republican leaders asking the Supreme Court to rule companies can fire workers based on their gender identity. Jacqueline Quinn is following this story for us this morning and she's here now with more. Hey Jacqueline. Yeah, hey, good morning. You know, this could be a huge blow to the LGBTQ community in this state. It all stems from a legal battle in Michigan where a transgender woman says she was fired from the funeral home where she worked. A lower court ruled federal anti-discrimination laws protected her, but Landry and others say the 1964 Civil Rights Act protects on the basis of sex, not gender identity. LGBT, uh, LGBTQ advocates say the legal briefing is outdated and the Supreme Court reversal would be damaging to thousands of families. This is about putting food on the table and the idea that somebody could fire me and keep me from feeding my family, from keeping my house, to keep me separated from society is harmful on so many levels. Now in 2016, Landry also successfully challenged Governor John Bell Edwards executive order, which protected LGBTQ people working for the state from discrimination. Yeah. This certainly could impact a lot of people depending on how it turns out. Yeah, Thank you very much, Jacqueline.